So this is an AI writing tool. It's a tool that allows you to generate articles, schedule your articles, and automatically publish your articles. Okay, now it works with the WordPress. So if you have a WordPress website, you can easily integrate it and have it right for your articles on autopilot. Okay, it's a very convenient tool, especially if you're someone who's busy. So the tool itself is called Blogena. I'll actually link it in the description. So just to show you the way it looks like, this is my website. And if I scroll down to the bottom, currently have it set at the footer, but you can have it set at the center of your article or at the top of your, uh, of your website, okay, or your homepage. So we have the articles over here. All of this is customizable. By default, it has my blog. And then you can also customize this. Yeah, welcome blog. So these are the articles that I have generated. We have the main article here. And down over here, we have other articles as well. So all of these were automatically generated, okay, based on the content of my website, okay? Now, it works well if you already have an existing website. So if you have an existing WordPress website, it's basically going to get information from that website and customize according to your data or according to your niche and the articles that you already have published. And this is how I have mine currently set up, okay? Just want to show you quickly how mine is set up. So... You have your dashboard over here. Okay, once you've set it up or once you have linked it to your website, it's going to tell you congratulations, you have successfully linked. Okay, and then you have your overview over here. Now you can write an article, if you want a new article to write. You can create an article idea and you can also schedule your next article. Okay, so currently I have five articles that have been uh, published and then you have zero drafts if you have one that is not complete and then you have one schedule. So I have one that is scheduled to be published today. Okay, here it's going to show you the last published article and the next, the next one that is scheduled. On the left hand side over here, you have my articles, and this is going to show you all the articles that you have published. And here's where you can actually change the settings for each of them. You can edit. It's going to show you the ones that have been published, the ones that are yet to be published, like this one is now scheduled. And if you want to edit before you publish it, you can actually click on edit over here, and you can edit it from here. You can also go ahead and delete if you want to delete, and also unschedule and publish as well. Okay, so this is the current articles that I have over here. And then you have configure my blog. So here is where you can now change your settings, like other articles where I was telling you to showing other articles over here. This section here, okay, you can have it say something else. By default, I think it was my blog. So you can have that changed. Your welcome message, you can also have a welcome message here. So maybe you can say something like, for example, welcome to my blog. Okay, and if you scroll down over here, you'll see your featured article. So this one that's featured at the top okay this one here the ultimate guide to ai power digital production so you can also go ahead and change that according to the ones that you already have published so you can select any of them okay so now if i click on save actually let me change this to read read more from my blog because welcome to my blog is already by default so let me say read read more from my blog okay now i'll click on save and configure uh, save configuration I'll come back over here and now if I refresh my website and I scroll down over here, you can see now it says read more from my blog. So I was just showing you that you can actually customize that and it's all completely customizable. You can select different articles and have them featured at the top over here. Next, you have your integrations. If you go over here to your integrations, it's going to show you how you've linked your website. So currently it's linked to my website as you can see here. And then lastly, you have your AI writer. Okay, so this section, you can actually customize it, if, especially if you have a brand new website, okay, which doesn't really have, you know, much information. So you can customize it and tell it basically what your website is about. So it, it currently picked this up from my website. It already knows the content from my website. You can give it a business overview, target your yeah, target audience, your value propositions, your expertise, demonstration, content strategy, and your market positioning. All right. And if you scroll down further over here, you can see your publication settings. So you, you can set it to publish on every day. It's currently set to every day, but you can select different days. If you want to select to publish it on selected days, you can go ahead and do that. You can also set it to publish automatically or have it validated first, or you can do it manually. And then you have the editorial tone. Okay. So this is one of the best features of this. It allows you to create art calls professionally or have a professional tone or a friendly tone or authoritative or conversational tone, okay? So to set this up, you're first going to go to integrations, okay? And what you want to do is to copy this code. This code is what you're going to install in your WordPress website, okay? It's actually a footer code. And down over here, 
it shows you how you how you're going to install it okay if you are on a wordpress website you're going to go to your themes editor and footer.php okay but i found this one to be a bit difficult to use okay i didn't really get where exactly footer php was so i actually used a plugin okay now if you have a shopify you're going to do it this way if you have a webflow website you're going to do it this way and you have others you can actually do it this way but it, it works best if you have a wordpress website okay we're going to install that code using a plugin okay so i'm going to go to my plugins in my website dashboard and the plugin that i want to use is called header footer script adder so i'll just type that in here okay oh, sorry i'm in the wrong section eh? i'm in the wrong section so i need to go to add plugin okay make sure you go to add plugin and then now you search it over here and this is the one here okay you're going to click on install now and click on activate all right and then you'll see it on your left hand side over here okay you're going to open it all right so here is where you're going to paste your code now you can paste it on your header you can paste it in the body itself or you can paste it in the footer okay i already have it pasted here in the footer so this time i'm going to paste it on my header so i'll just copy this code okay i'll just cut it from here and then i paste it here okay now when you'll first get your code this is how it's going to look like okay you'll have this section here blogina.ai integration code paste just before now the problem is that it also shows this it also shows this section so what i did i just removed this section over here okay you want to remove it and then just paste this section down here these two lines over here okay that is why you're seeing these two lines you're seeing the first one and the second line okay once you are done with that you can now click on save script okay you're then going to come back over here and now you're going to enter your website over here okay so again i'll enter my website click on test all right so it's going to tell you the integration is successful and your blog is now connected now you can click on visit my site and again this is how it's going to look like you have your articles there and i have it set up on my header okay now below is the rest of my website all right so now i'm going to head back over to our dashboard and we're going to write an article okay just click on write a new article and here's where you can enter your topic you can enter the cover image you can enter your article summary and then here you can enter the rest of the content now here on your dashboard you can do write a new article create a new article or schedule the next article now you can actually create an article here an article idea and as you can see it says right here an article idea or draft a start and then the AI will process it soon to transform it into a complete article so for example i want to write an uh, article on ai video generation tools and then here i'll enter my initial content so i'll just basically say how ai tools have impacted uh, content creation all right and then i click on save all right so what will happen the ai tool is going to actually generate a content or generate or write an article on this title okay on ai video generation tools as you can see it says you are ready to generate and it's upcoming so that is just one of the best features that you can do over here you can also add another idea if you want to keep on doing that you can also write an article manually if you want to do that okay you can just simply if you want to write it manually you can also use chat gpt or if you just want to type it old school using your own thoughts you can just simply click on write a new article or click on new article over here you enter your article title you choose your image you enter your article summary and your content right there so let's say i want to write an article from clickbank okay i would go over to clickbank and I just look for offers here on clickbank let's say i want to write an article uh, on meter lane on this product or this product whatever product it is okay let me just go the first one here so now i'll go over to chat gpt and ask it to write me an article okay an article on mitolin so i'll get more information from mitolin i'll come back over here i'll get the sales page i'll view the sales page because i want to get more information so that i have chat gpt writing correct information so it says here unblock your metabolic power um so it does a detox cleanse and flush your organs okay uh, i'm gonna scroll down further so what i'll do i'll basically just copy all this okay i'll copy all this now this can't really be copied so what i'll do i'll just snap it or i'll snip it using a snipping tool okay i'll snip this whole section like this i come back to chat gpt and then i'll say based on the uploaded image okay and then i attach that image 
click on open this should be uploaded image so i hit enter and there we have our article so what i'll do i'll first get the title okay come back over here and paste our title there okay pretty simple come back over here and now get the rest of this i come back and i paste the rest of that article there okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to add an image of that product as well i come back over here to the sales page and i grab an image from here actually let me look for another image here yeah, this one looks pretty good so again i'll just snip this because i can't save i'll snip it come back again over here we choose that image and click on open okay now to add your affiliate link it's pretty simple just add a call to action if you've been in my channel long enough you already know what we're going to do we're going to add a call to action okay so i'll just pretty much say click here to try metalin okay so you highlight this over here and then you come back up over here they have this link you click on that link and then you add your affiliate link pretty much get your affiliate link from here click on get affiliate link select your nickname click on continue scroll down you click on copy come back over here and then you paste your affiliate link right there and then you accept and then you scroll back up over here and click on save so currently as you can see it's on draft but if you go to articles you will see it over here all right it currently it's a draft but if you want to do more actions like you can actually schedule it to publish it later you can publish it instantly you can edit you can delete and you can also ready to generate so if you click on ready to generate you can actually have ai automatically generate so you don't have to write the ad call yourself manually this is also another feature that you can also allow it to do and write it for you your ad calls without having to write it manually okay but i'll just cancel that so that is pretty much how you can use this tool blogena the best thing about this tool is that it's convenient okay you can actually use it so let's say if you're someone who's busy you can just have your art calls written maybe on you can you can actually set up your art calls to be written or to be published on separate days giving you free time to do other things